brother Othella? Price to the price. That's how easy it is. Alright, what's the active ingredient? Okay, so it's My sister Erica. My mom. My nephew. You guys know Kingston. And it's the cheerleader. She doesn't want to talk. She's too good for us. And then we have my brother over there. My other brother. He's being antisocial. But. Wait, do they make that? Fancy. Okay. Yeah. It, I didn't pay the cost to be the no, boss. I never seen one like that before. Yeah. How do you eat on camera? Let's see. Be a lady. Ooh. <laughs> She's a lady. And look who taught her. Megasa. <laughs> you. That's all that is. They have Comsi and Comsa. <laughs> for those of y'all that don't know, that's Creole for like this and like that, okay? No. Y'all, we were just talking because uh, it's also my cousin's birthday, my mom's nephew. And we just was talking about family and whatnot. And I just, not just realized, but my mama is one of 15, y'all. My mama is the eighth child, right? You the middle child? She's the eighth child. She has seven siblings older than her and seven siblings younger than her. What? I can't even fathom that having 14 other siblings. But all of your children are born by the time you're 30. Like grandma had all the kids by the time she was 30, right? What? 36? Yeah. So you had 15 kids by the time you were 36. I can't even. Baby, I'm 33 and I only got two. And we can't deal. <laughs> so by the time she was 32, she had what? No, I'm saying like by the time like my age, 32, she would have had like 12 kids, 11 children. She had uh, minus four. Oh my god! I can't. I can barely handle two. Okay. But. The blessing of it all is that out of 15 children, mom is still like, she has nine siblings here with her. Like that's yeah, a blessing that's true. to still have nine of your siblings still living. Yes, yes, you know, They're all doing well in their own respective, you know, lives. And yes. We have, you know, nine uncles and aunts that are still here. Yep. That's a blessing. Yes. Good genes. Yes, very good genes. <laughs> We need to do a family reunion too. That's coming. We need That's to do a coming. family reunion, y'all. Yep. Oh my gosh. But I, they always had, they had a lot of big families back in the day, huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But, I don't know. Yeah. 17? 22. 22 what? 22 kids? Yeah. By the same woman. <laughs> oh my god, yo. Yeah. 22 kids to go play on a farm? But first of all, you gotta think about it. Based on the investigation, that's we have two, three kids. And you like, how do we make it? How do we survive? How do we yes. How back then? How were they doing that back then? Children, and you have to feed, clothe, bathe, keep your sanity. Fifteen children. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Right. Where's, where's your peace of mind? Where's your privacy? You don't have them. You think you could handle fifteen children? No? I can barely handle my five. I didn't think you were going to have five. How many you wanted? Two. <laughs> I was supposed to stop at Dartanian. But I got involved in the church. Oh, and yeah, they did yeah, not yeah. believe in contraceptive. Yeah. Oh, okay. Kept on. <laughs> Kept on keeping on. Keep on keeping on. Multiply. 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 And replenish the earth, boo. <laughs> I wanted four and then had one. I said, well, you know, maybe. Try again. Had my second. 
Yeah. After two, I was done. I didn't want no more. You good, boy and a girl? Yeah, you're done. It's not that deep. No. <laughs> it's not that serious. No. You look soft with your boy and your girl. I did. And I, I did probably still would have stopped. stopped. I had her and I had D. Yeah. Even though well, yeah, you had your boy and your girl. Miles, Stella, and you. Uh, immaculate. <laughs> Y'all, she said that every single time we talk about this. <laughs> she don't know how she got pregnant. Stella uh, Thella was not immaculate conception. Because y'all were married. No. Oh, man. Miles, I don't know. But <laughs> Brandon, that definitely. Was cool, but you definitely, I'm serious, man. That's insane. Yeah, yeah y'all, because that's another thing. My sister and I are 19 years yes. apart. 19 years apart. So Homga was in college by the time I was born. Thank you. You want to explain yourself, Janelle? No. Immaculate she said conception. no. <laughs> Two words. Immaculate conception. That's, what That's the only way to explain that. That's it. That's it. Oh my God. And she was such an angel when she was oh, born. When she came out, she was such an angel. <laughs> Oh my god, that hair and that little angelic face. Oh my gosh, she was so cute. You wasn't mad no more, huh? <laughs> oh, once I found out you were a girl, I wasn't mad. Oh, you was fine. I was excited. Once Mama found out it was a girl, I was like, okay. Got my little sister. Got my little sister. Oh, and look, I'm still <laughs> bugging her to this day. <laughs> yes, used to comb her hair and mm -hmm. clean her hair. And... Yep. But I, I was in college, so I wasn't here. You know? Yeah. She abandoned she me. She felt abandoned. <laughs> yeah. Then I got married on her. Oh, Lord. That was I it. wanted to beat her husband. <laughs> that was it. I got the pictures to prove it, too. <laughs> Sorry, Jay. Oh, well. If JP oh, watched still this. Still together. Still together. <laughs> I should have had some little questions or something. So oh, we didn't, so know we, did. we didn't know we was going to do all of that. Mm -mm -mm. Like I said, some of the best times are unplanned. Yeah, that's true. That is very so true. We're listen to, is this, what is this? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I think that's I like from your mom. Bags. I like bags. <laughs> well, I didn't know because it said congrats. congrats. So I'm like. Well, you know, you, know, you got to. Yeah. Well, it's best As when it's unplanned, right? Right. Recycle <laughs> <laughs> right. okay. birthday bags. Look, <laughs> 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 Cause look, I, I do all the edges. I... Hey! Mm -hmm. What happened yeah. to my massage, though? Oh, I got, I got you down to the, the massage. You got to do the whole scab ring. Oh you God. next. Uh-uh. You no, next. Can't put this claws on. You see? <laughs> what? <laughs> I, got, I got it on my nails, huh? What? Oh what? my god! <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, boy, you just sit up on to school. Brandon, this would be great for your uh, your hair, curly, you know, your channel when you're right. Hey, like, look, this, this a scalp is, massage is very good. With to oil, I do, I, do, I, do, I do, I do this. You know what I'm saying? All you gotta do is call me. How much me, do you charge, sir? Set, set up, set up an appointment. How much you I, charge, sir? And I um for a fifteen minutes scalp massage. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a scat. <laughs> that was not the question. I no. asked how much are your services for a fifteen minute scalp massage? Oh, scalp massage. Fifteen ninety nine. <laughs> oh my 
59.9, you going you going to love it. You going you going you going you going you going you going to look back and you going to say, "Oh my god." Oh my god. I'm telling you. I, look, look, look. I even, I even. <laughs> I even, I even get behind the, I, be get, I, I even get behind the eel. I get behind the eel. Stop. Stop. Good morning. Can you see what time it is? No, you cannot. It is 11. 10. It is 11 o'clock. And I'm so tired, y'all. This week has been so <sighs> hectic i think might be a good word <sighs> i'm just so tired the kids are tired i wish i could have slept longer but it is the sabbath day so happy sabbath my good people um I'm about to get ready to go downstairs. I'm about to take my um, aligners out, brush my teeth, wash my face, all that. No, I have not done that yet, okay? But that's what I'm about to do. And I'm about to go downstairs, fix a little breakfast. Um, maybe do my coffee. I don't know yet what I really want to do. Or even if I want to eat or drink something like I don't know I'm just so tired and I do not physically want to do anything but uh our church sermon comes on around 12 30 we watch the the lives that come on on YouTube um and I'm not gonna be able to go by my mom today because Hezzy's using my car so I'm gonna get into that later on but I'm taking out my teeth <sighs> It's Kingston! Y'all, how, what is all of this? Like, how does this get on the paint? First of all, I know that the kids, they literally take their wet fingers and draw on the wall. Like, what is that? We're gonna have to literally repaint this or something because so this is ridiculous. Can you it? Yeah, you can. So that's your little fingers doing that. No, it's not. I bet it was. I never done that. Mm-hmm. No, I promise. Hold it. Hi guys. Look, you can see yourself. Yeah. If you pull it back like this, you can see yourself. I'm gonna brush my teeth. Did you brush your teeth yet since you've been up? No. Whenever I want to use the bathroom. You're lying. I'm not lying. <laughs> I'm shy. I did brush my tongue. <clears throat> we're doing like something about like going somewhere, but I don't know where we're going. Do you guys know? Comment down below. If you know. Guys, hit that subscribe buddy so my mom can get to a thousand subscribers. Because I wonder if she gets a plaque from YouTube. Yeah, I would love to get a plaque from YouTube. Yeah. Let's go downstairs. That would be so cool. That would be so cool. Yeah. Cause we're so cool. Well, mom, how many how many subscribers do you need to get to? thousand. Yeah. Like ninety. <laughs> That's a lot. Bobita, Bobita, Bobita. To help you, Bobita, Bobita. And guys, to save you. And he's my little Bobby. Look at the camera. Look at the camera. And he's the little bubby. You want what you said you want a peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Yeah. Yeah. Um, 
yeah so it is the sabbath so y'all know you're not supposed to cook you're not supposed to shop you're not supposed to buy uh you're not supposed to uh do anything that is considered like working that's what you are not supposed to do on the sabbath day the sabbath day it is one of the ten commandments i don't know if a lot of people know that say I know that's right bo say that's one of the ten commandments okay keep the sabbath day okay the seventh day of the week is the sabbath day okay guys subscribe if you love our little dog bo yes if you love our dog bo subscribe to the channel so yeah um and like i said for the most part i think i said this before on another video like i still don't know like exactly what i can and cannot do so I know for a fact I'm not supposed to go to work. I'm not supposed to do anything like physically demanding. Um, I know I'm not supposed to shop. I know I'm not supposed to cook anything unless it's like a feast day or like a holy day where we have to cook for, you know, as an offering to the Lord. But I still don't know like exactly what I can and can't do. Like I know I can't put my coffee pot on. I try not to use the microwave because um, that's like... Like if you're taking something out of the freezer and you put it in the microwave, you're technically like cooking it because you can't eat it frozen. You feel what I'm saying? So that part. So I'm fixing Kingston a sandwich and I'm going to fix me probably just some coffee, like my cold coffee. And we're going to call that a day and we're going to go sit on the sofa. And yes, Bo is barking up a storm. He wants to play. That's what he does when he wants to play. Go get daddy. When he wants to play that, he starts barking like a man. He think he a man in my house, y'all. So that's what I'm about to do. And we're going to go sit on the sofa and um, just wait until the Sabbath day sermon starts. Decided to fix me a bowl of cereal. And Kingston too because we ain't got no bread. <laughs> I just realized we don't have no bread. So we're going to have to go to the store probably later on or tomorrow. And um, after I eat my cereal, I'm going to fix my protein coffee and then maybe read a little bit of the Bible and wait for the sermon to come on. But y'all, it's been a hectic week because Rozzy is in cheerleading now. She made the cheerleading team for her school back in April. And this week was cheer camp. And sis had to be there um, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Tuesday was like a half a day. But they were staying till like 8, 9 o'clock at night. And then I had to be there in the morning for 7.45. And they wouldn't get out till like 9 o'clock at night, y'all. So getting out of the house, getting off from work, having to go pick her up. Going pick up Kingston from my mom's house, taking care of the dog, and then, um, you know, most of the time during the week, Hezzy's not home because he is a truck driver. So he is out on the road doing his thing for work. So Monday through Friday, most of the time, I'm thugging it out by myself. So I'm doing all this back and forth, picking up, dropping off, um, making sure we have something to eat. Um, you know, just it, it was a lot this week. So, Rosie's actually still upstairs sleeping. Um, and like I said, we just woke up. So, then plus we were at my mom's house last night like y'all saw. So, my goodness. And also, we've been rolling with just one car right now because Hezzy's truck is on the blink. So, when he's home on the weekends... He's been using my car. Or when he's home during the week, he has to use my car. So I couldn't go to my mom's house today because he's using my car to go and check on his truck to see, you know, what's going on with it. So we're home in the house. Gonna have to watch on the TV. And maybe we'll do something later on. Me and him talked about maybe going out to eat or something. And 
that's about it oh and it also it's also my friend's birthday tonight so i don't know what they're doing or i don't know not too sure and then tomorrow rosie has to go take cheer pictures tomorrow morning so it's been a full week y'all i'm just like really tired i told hezzy we need to go on a vacation like asap because y'all i'm just tired i'm tired of working i'm tired of doing the back and forth the errands the everything y'all i just need a break i need a good vacation i need to be on somebody's beach with a drink in my hand honey now we were supposed to go to houston this weekend but that got canceled because of cheer camp and rosie has pictures tomorrow and all that because that was kind of like a last minute situation so couldn't do that but me and hezzy are going to houston in a few weeks so hopefully we'll get to relax a little bit we're just going for one uh like an overnight stay that's all and spend the day there so i hope that you know comes in handy with our mental with a little mental vacation and i told him to like september ish we need to go somewhere like we need to go somewhere because normally september is a good month to like go to the beach because it's after all of the summertime crowd stuff starts to get a little cheaper so yeah all right, y'all, so I'm going to show y'all how I make my protein coffee. This is just the Equate Caramel Protein from Walmart. It has 30 grams of protein, and I love this Stoke coffee. And I literally just mix the two together, taste it to see if I want more coffee or if I need a little bit more sweetener. But I normally like it to taste more like coffee, and I know y'all like my Southern University mug. Shout out to Southern Go Jags. And just for a little bit of extra sweetness, I'll either put this in, the coffee creamer, or I'll use my no sugar sweetener to add a little something, something to the coffee. And that's it. All right, y'all. So today's the next day. It's Sunday and it is 1 30. we actually got a really 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 early start this morning because rosie had cheer pictures this morning so we woke up literally at seven o'clock in the morning to wash her hair and do her hair uh, because like i was telling y'all she had cheer camp all last week so her hair was pretty much done um frizzy dirty all that good stuff so we washed it this morning to get it nice and fresh for her cheerleading pictures so i can't wait for those to come out i chose some really 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 beautiful poses i cannot wait to get them back from the photographer uh what else did we do i washed my hair i used a new wash and go combo and i'm low-key liking it that's the tv so loud i feel like i'm probably gonna have to repeat everything i just said because the tv is like really loud damn we we just gonna thug it out y'all but yeah i washed my hair i used a new combo i'll probably share with y'all at a later time what the combo is because this is actually my second weekend in a row trying a new wash and go combo so i'm trying to see which one i like the best so that way i can do a video on it to say like you know my updated curly hair routine or like holy grail type stuff so i'm kind of waiting to see what i like and what works the best so far the combo i tried last week was better than what i have in my hair right now but i still do like what i have in my hair right now it seems like it's it's pretty good so we are cleaning up doing my usual on sundays wash clothes wash dishes clean up the house pick up mop all that stuff I'm gonna wash the dog later on and we're actually about to go to whole foods real quick because y'all i have just been bloated and aggravated and like my body is just not where i needed to be i have been like working out a lot and i've been doing this 1200 calorie diet and it's been working but the last couple of days i think it's because i'm about to start my cycle like i've just been so bloated and like craving stuff and just aggravated so i lost like nine pounds but then i gained two back 
because of the day that I had Friday. I just wanted to eat everything, y'all. And since then, my stomach has just been like gassy, crampy, bloated, like just not normal. So I want to go to Whole Foods and get some juices and fruits and salads. And that's all I want to eat next week and do like a total detox of my body, okay? Hey guys, look who it is. Did y'all know anything about my dad? He's always the last one dressed. <laughs> Cause that actually is true. <laughs> Subscribe if you think that's true. <laughs> Go ahead, Kingston. Tell them people the and truth. He be rushing us, but he don't be rushing himself. Right. So he's always the last one. Always. If comment down below. Hey y'all comment and we down below. Do some pranks on it. Think about all that. Lies. <laughs> all lies. Yo, he does this all the time. This is the finished product guys. I made some lima beans with sausage and we got some chicken tenders from Cane's because I did not feel like frying no chicken today. So that's what we eating for dinner. And I got a little bit of Tabasco. You know you can't have your little meal without a little bit of Tabasco. And uh, we about to dig in baby, okay? <laughs> <laughs> 